Okay, so this is just a little short portion of the Hummingbird Creek up upstream of the falls. And it's uh, December 10th, 2015. So this is a trip that my mother-in-law and my wife and I have been looking forward to for a couple of months. We've got the entire Hummingbird area all to ourselves. A little bit of fresh snow. This is, this is what you want to get away to. Okay, so this is just another, oh, six, seven hundred meters further upstream. That is some prime trout fishing right in there. It's a little bit hazy today. We had sunshine this morning, but pristine wilderness. Well, good morning, folks. So it's Saturday morning, uh, December 12th. I'm, I'm the only person alive at camp this morning. It's, I think it's about 8 o'clock. sun just came up. We've been out here now since Tuesday. And it's just progressively got a little cooler every, every night. Um, so by the way, this is... Uh, that's Marley. He's my little camp camp guard my guard moose I guess so as you can see it is minus 20 Celsius we've got the camp all set up here so good old hummingbird I've got a little feeder over there for my whiskey jacks So there's the camp. I got a couple of girls in there, my mother-in-law and my wife. Last night we had a great fish feed, some salmon steaks. Tonight it's going to be steaks. As you can see, the stove is putting out really good. The old four dog stove's got it about plus 20 inside there, so you're looking at 40 degrees difference. Tried a couple of new things this time. Actually brought a Coleman, a Coleman oven, and that's what we broiled the um, fish on last night. So got a little nice little table. Everything fits real nice in the, in my vestibule. I couldn't do it. I couldn't. I couldn't do winter camping with, without my vestibule. So we'll let the girls finish sleeping in here. <laughs> 